Imagine strong, effective products made of nothing more than salt, water, and an electrical charge. Through the process of electrolysis or electrochemical activation, the salt water is transformed into analyte water, a disinfectant when used in appropriate concentrations. The active ingredient in the resulting solution is hypochlorous acid, a naturally occurring acid also found in the human body's response to fighting infections. The hypochlorous acid in analyte can serve much the same purpose outside the human body as the naturally occurring acid does inside the human body. Inside the body, it helps destroy pathogens through a process called phagocytosis. Essentially, the cell membrane bursts and destroys the DNA. It is no longer able to mutate or multiply. Outside the human body, the hypochlorous acid at specific concentrations destroys the cell membrane of certain bacterial and viral cells, preventing these cells from doing any further damage. Analyte water is not new. It begins with an English scientist around 1834. His work on electrolysis opened the door for the creation of the naturally occurring biocide, hypochlorous acid, through an electrochemical reaction. During World War I, a French surgeon and British biochemist created a method to flush the interior surfaces of soldiers' wounds with hypochlorous acid that had been stabilized. The men whose wounds were treated with the hypochlorous acid wash were less likely to develop sepsis and saved countless lives. Today, science with medical research and development has allowed for stabilization and continues to prove the effectiveness of analyte water. It is available now as a multi-purpose solution that can be used daily as a safer alternative for disinfecting, cleansing, sanitizing, deodorizing, and first aid. No gloves or rinsing necessary.